It's been so long since I played this game. I kind of forgot how to. So some of this playthrough was me trying to figure out what the controls were, and the other parts of it was me running away trying not to die. Not because I'm a coward or anything, but because, like... Uh... I don't know. I don't even know why I run back and forth a lot. But I think it was mainly to double check places I've been to make sure I didn't miss anything. And the game is still very much fun. I was think I was trying to figure out if it'd be quicker for me to go back places. And um by going back up and exploring a bit, I was able to figure out, you know, my way around the place and it's been really helpful and no more places to go than less is really good. So, um Thanks for watching so far. If you like the series, please leave a comment. And if you want to see another game, leave another comment or join our Discord and just harass me until I start making it. You never know what might happen. Anyway, let's go on to uh, this episode. So um, we're descending into the pits of uh, the swampy area because we went down the cistern into um, this place and there was a little butcher guy in the as well go over the fight with him while we're here so um basically i'm not sure how strong these things are before i fight them so my plan was to get rid of the dog first and then try to fight from there and i'm not sure how hard they're gonna hit me either or what else is gonna appear behind me while i'm fighting so the plan is to get a gauge on how many hit points they have and hit them when they can't hit me back unfortunately i didn't know this flame guy was gonna come up either so Turns out I was in a bad spot the whole time, and I did manage to get through this guy. He's, um, luckily a mod that doesn't respawn, so. Hi there, welcome back to our Let's Play of Dark Souls, I'm your host Halsey, and um, I got a quick way back to the place I was going last episode, so that's neat. I forgot how to run though, it's been a couple of weeks since the last recording. Um, so basically I can one shot these guys, in fact even less than that, I've got a few thousand souls to work with. We're going to a new area, oh, bombs. Might have arrested myself here. That's okay. Oh, forgot those guys were there. It's okay. They serve. Oh, they stand no chance. They serve no purpose. They are dead. I hope this way is quicker though. Anyway, we get to go this way. So, if you remember the last episode, we found a new way to go, and this is pretty much it. This is where that leads to the sewers. And the old person who sells the item. I'm gonna be collecting for the way. They sell moss, but I'm actually not after them. I'm after these, which I can't get. To undead bird. Can they pronounce that? Let me know in the comments how it's pronounced phonetically. I'd like to know. So I came down from this way. Really different than going up. So many people place markers that don't matter. Oh well. This is my first time in this area specifically, so let's have some fun. Oh. 
Oh crap. Oh my sword. Oh shit, how do I get out of this? It's been so long. I'm trying to make minor or major mistakes here. Like if I it was a song it'd be so off key, it'd be a different song. Making like a little Wayne song or something. And let's see. Oh crap. That's just fire apparently. Let's run from that. Two. Three. I was not expecting that at all. Seems like a bad person. Let's take out time reversing this area. Don't want to be caught off guard. Didn't work, did it? What the? Okay, game. Um. All right. The butcher. There's always one of these. So what does he do? Oh, he dies easily. Oh, crap. Heal up. Two. Three. Four. Okay. I don't know who he was, but War Sack. He got sack tapped. If that's how it works, right? Ooh. I'm just dragging him along for the ride. Are you both slow in our water? That's a good new mechanic game. Oh, girl. This waiting's not good for me. I can't go this way. Oh, another one. So maybe they respawn. That was close. He came out of there? No. You're right. Why am I playing this at night in the sand on? Because...
Oh crap. What was that? Good to know. <laughs> yeah, they can't come out of the water. Oh, now this guy's here too. Fuck this guy. <sighs> kind of feel like going back to get rid of these like, souls. It's just 7,000 of them. I might jump cut to my way back. I figure out which one's really shorter, getting here from Firelink or getting... Um... Well, we have a shot. You. Yes, yes, you. Here, over here. Please, you must help me. There you are. Or else, she'll have me for lunch. You're my only hope. Oh, please. How do I help you? Do I stab you? Oh. I would have been a supper without you. Been eating alive. I shut up. Thank you. Thank you. I am Luetius. Or the Great Swamp. I'm glad I help people. What's he do? Oh, hello there. I'm fine, thank you. That's all he says? Okay. I think I'm going back just because I used a few Asterix Flasks that I didn't really want to as well. That doesn't help. Um... I think I'm leveling up my Fae for that sword as well. He has to respawn on his own. That's weird. I don't even know if this is enough souls to level up, but I got a soul of the unknown soldier, so it should be. What the? Now it's respawn. Everything respawned? That was weird. So let me know in the comments why everything respawned. Okay. Oh, you know I could do that. That's very helpful to know.
So what was faith? Okay, cool. I can, I can definitely do that. the now since I seem to be fighting in corridors a bit I might also use a lot my plus two long sword is my offhand oh. My plus four halberd on first. Yes, I plan out my weapons this way. Like, oh, I'm fighting close quarters. I will use a sword. You fighting long quarters. I use a um, not sword. Like open areas. This is great. Close off. Not so much. I don't have to worry about 3,000 souls on my next step, so... Don't know how I killed them both, but I'm not gonna argue with the results. Hello. Welcome to the stream. I mean, the video. Yeah, it's had to be on camera. It's like, you know what? I'm gonna jump for it. And they did. Props to them. Props to them. Now, since you can kill everything, there's actually different ways to finish this game, which is kind of cool. So yeah, the plan is once I get into that sewer area to change my sword and shield, then I should have a better chance of progressing just because the sword and shield. I mean, it's not as upgraded as my halberd, but considering what's down there, I feel like it's gonna be a better pick. Plus I weigh a little bit less and my parries work better, so that's why. Oh crap, I'm oh, dead. What you were dead. That could have been bad. So their thing is that they're good in numbers. I don't want these guys getting close, so once I get about my frame of hitting them, that's when I need to stab. Oh crap! Wow. Okay. <laughs> Guess we'll see you next episode. stick verse whatever the fuck these are we can go downstairs 